billboards. No, no. Yo no lo digo, de la música pop que estamos hablando de Taylor Swift. Y bebé, ¿cómo ponen? Ya bebé. Claro, María, su música en la Nashville. Ella empezó a hacer su música en Nashville, una de la música country. Ahora ya amplió muchísimo la frontera de los Swift, de su música, sobre todo en su último disco, Red, que editó el año pasado. Ahora lo está presentando en Estados Unidos en una gira impresionante, vendiendo miles y miles de entradas. Por ejemplo, en el Cowboy Stadium de Dallas, donde tuvimos, tocó para 60.000 personas esta chica que tiene 23 años y que es puro en todo el mundo y obviamente también aquí en la Argentina. Muchos están esperando que traiga esta gira que tiene una producción impresionante de su disco Red aquí a Sudamérica. Vamos a ver qué nos dice en la nota. Y hay una sorpresita al final, porque también, además de conocer a Taylor Swift, conocimos a el fan número uno argentino que había dejado a dar a esa verdad. ¿Al fan número I've always been so proud of this album because it's so diverse and I really experimented with the way that I write music and um, took a lot of chances and I feel like those chances paid off and, and to be playing the songs live now on tour it just kind of it just kind of amplifies how proud I am with the record. How do you manage to be a normal girl, being so young and so successful, being loved in, in all the world? At Aww. least you seem to be normal. That was nice. Um, I think that, you know, my life has a lot of abnormal circumstances, and I think self-awareness is really key. And also, I think that staying normal is, is all about how you continue to live your life. I still gro go grocery shopping. I still, you, you know, that? hang all the pictures in my house. And I, and I love it, and I like living that way, and that's why I live that way. <laughs> Everyone was telling me, when you meet Taylor, please ask her if she's willing to come to South America. I would to love to. Do you have any plans? I, we are planning things. I can't tell you exactly what, because we haven't, don't have everything nailed down yet, but we are definitely in the beginning stages of planning. For what you told me, I, I realized that it's 80% of possibilities that someday you will be playing in Argentina. Someday, we definitely 80, 70, will. 90? 100% we will definitely be coming to Argentina at some point. Okay. <laughs> Yesterday I was here in Dallas, oh. where we are now, and I received a message of the president of the fans club of Taylor Swift in Argentina. He saved money during three years to come to this tour and he has a present to give you. He's here. He's Sebastián. Hi! Oh, nice to meet you. Oh. Hey! Thank you for coming. Oh, thank you. He has a present for the Argentine fans. Yeah, from our, from they made you a present. Letter from a faraway yeah. land. Is this, are you sure you want to read this? Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is amazing. Oh. Thank you for your time, Taylor. Thank you so much. Lovely. Thank you. And thank you for receiving the fan number one. I love it. Thank you. Thank, thank you. Awesome. Thank you. What a great surprise. <laughs> amazing. Thank you so much. Lovely.
Bueno, y tiene más que claro que es ahora la chica del momento para todos los adolescentes, para los jóvenes, prejúvenes, chicos jóvenes. Me gusta muchísimo, se escucha muchísimo, suena mucho. Es la más exitosa. Sí, por favor. No sé.